Hello everyone, in this video we are going to learn what are Pythagorean triplets, how to find them and to check whether the three numbers are Pythagorean triplets or not. So Pythagorean triplets as the name suggests are the numbers which follow the Pythagorean law. That means the square of one of the numbers is the sum of the square of the other two numbers. So suppose we have been given a number 6 and we need to find the Pythagorean triplets to this number. The method for finding the Pythagorean triplets is very easy. For any natural number, any natural number m, 2m, m square plus 1 and m square minus 1 are Pythagorean triplets. Let us now solve few examples and find out the Pythagorean triplet for number 6. So here we have three numbers 2m, m square plus 1 and m square minus 1. Let us suppose that 2m is equal to 6. So m will be equal to 6 divided by 2 which is equal to 3. So m comes out to be 3. Now the other two numbers will be m square plus 1 which is equal to 3 square plus 1 which is equal to 9 plus 1 gives us 10. And the other number will be m square minus 1 which is 3 square minus 1 and it comes out to be 9 minus 1 equals 8. So the other two numbers are 10 and 8. The three numbers are 6, 8 and 10. To check whether the three numbers are Pythagorean triplets or not, we will take the biggest number among the three. So biggest number is 10. The square of the biggest number will will be equal to the sum of the square of the other two numbers. Let us check whether these numbers follow this or not. So 10 square is 100, 6 square is 36 and 8 square is 64. And 36 plus 64 is 100. So this comes out to be true. Hence the three numbers 6, 8 and 10 are Pythagorean triplets. Let us now solve one more example where one of the Pythagorean triplet number is given to us which is equal to 16. So here 2m is equal to 16. So m will be equal to 16 divided by 2 which is equal to 8. So m is equal to 8. Now we need to find m square plus 1 and m square minus 1. So m square plus 1 will be 8 square plus 1 is equal to 64 plus 1 is equal to 65. And m square minus 1 will be equal to 8 square minus 1 which is equal to 64 minus 1 equals 63. Hence our Pythagorean triplets are 16, 63 and 65. Let us now check whether the 3 follow the rule or not. So 65 square should be equal to 63 square plus 16 square for these numbers to be the Pythagorean triplets. So let us now check. So 63 square is 3969 and 16 square is 256 and 65 square is 4225. Let us now add the 2. By adding the 2 we are getting 4225. That means the 3 numbers 16 63 and 65 are Pythagorean triplets. This is how you can find Pythagorean triplets if one of the number is given. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.